Berlin, Massachusetts. Yeah. And it started not one, but two open mics, a spoken word open mic on Wednesdays and on Sunday night music or spoken word, anything goes. And they love him so much in Lynn, Massachusetts that he was given the key to the city by the mayor. Please welcome him all the way from Lynn, John White. I'm so thrilled to be here and to be with all these great artists and to be supporting this uh, the birthday of this great man. And um, I want to sort of um, zero in on the on the work that he did for working people. You know, he did a lot of things, but as a as a just you know as the son of a factory worker and a man who worked in construction most of my life, I really appreciate the fact that he and Woody Guthrie and Utah Phillips and all these guys dedicated their lives to um, to, to this idea of um, working people having a, a place at the table. I'm going to do two songs on that subject. first one's kind of general, and the second one is about the time when I... Um, I worked for a company that was owned by Tyco uh, during the time when the CEO um, stole $100 million for the company, and all of a sudden we had three less sick days and everything. Um, we had to pay for it there. Um, so here's the first one, and then we'll get to that. And this one, I, I really feel peace in doing this one. All the work gets done in the valley. All the money rains down on the mountain top. When the money trickles down to the people in the valley, it's only one little drop, one little drop to feed the family. One little drop to pay the medical bill. One little drop to pay the mortgage to the banker sold it to the man at the top of the hill. Oh, they worked so hard to divide us with a steady stream of lies. Cause if we ever stop fighting with each other, we might start asking each other why. If all the work gets done in the valley, why did all the money rain down on the mountain top? When the money trickles down to the people in the valley, why is it just a little drop? One little drop to feed the family, one little drop to pay the medical bill, one little drop to pay the mortgage to the banker who sold it to the man. Just keep buying those politicians and those TV newsmen to make them say every day that my problem is my neighbor when I know that my problem is you. And keep on lying about corporate tax breaks. How the jobs are gonna trickle down But beware of the day when the people say that they are sick of being trickled on One little drop to feed the family One little drop to pay the medical bills One little drop to pay the mortgage to the banker Who sold it to the man at the top starts moving, it is impossible to stop every flood that ever washed a city away. You know it started with a little drop, one little drop will start an ocean, one little drop will start a rain, one little drop will 
start the flood that's coming to wash the gilded city away if all of the work gets done in the valley why does all the money rain down on the mountain top when the money trickles down to the people in the valley why is it just a little drop Systems. I come from a town in Massachusetts, it's kind of a factory town, and I've been, I installed security systems for 20 years, um, mostly kind of a public service. I was really just trying to keep my friends out of other people's houses. <laughs> but during this time, uh, um, you know, because they, the CEO, what was his name, Kozlowski, he stole $100 million from the company. We All of a sudden, we woke up with like two sick days instead of five and, you know, all that stuff. And so some guys in the, in the company decided to, to bring it to a vote. And so I actually am a folk singer who lived through putting a union into a, into a building. Like all the things I read about from Woody Guthrie and Pete Seeger, they were all true, like spies at the meetings and like, like people pulling you aside, hey, you know, if you vote against this thing, we'll take care of you. You know, your life could be really difficult. We know you were, you know, all that stuff. So um, I, think I'm, I think I'm authentic. <laughs> Our CEO is having a very nice life. Throwing million dollar birthday parties for him and his wife. Boy, he stole 100 million from the company. All the ground started shaking under Mr. Kozlowski. At the trial, he, at the trial, he assembled an impressive legal team. The most impressive group of lawyers that anybody'd ever seen. All the king's horses and all the king's men failed to keep the greedy CEO from going to jail. When the boss rips the company off, you know what they say. That it's the workers and their families that have to pay. So for the next three years, the company froze our pay. And then one by one, they took our benefits away. guys on the crew who decided to try take it to a vote to try to unionize and every one of them knew that there is no harder fight than to try to force a corporation to do what's right there were spies at the union meetings who reported back to the bosses at the office and all the other company had they use intimidation, all right, lies and bribery too. Hey, if you vote against the union, we'll take good care of you. on everybody on that crew. You could feel it every day, man, it weighed down hard on you. Not knowing if we lost how we keep our families fed, but still one by one we all stood up and said, we are willing to fight for what is right. We are willing to fight for what is right. If we lose, we know what that could do to the whole rest of our lives. But we are willing to fight for what is right. There was so much pride and dignity in the air. And I swear that Pete and Woody were standing there. When we stood beneath the shadow of all that money and might. And 
said we are willing to fight for what is right and you can't scare me i'm sticking to the union stick to the union stick to the union oh you can't scare me i'm sticking to the union i'm sticking to the union till the day i die sing it with me oh you can't scare me i'm sticking to the union i'm sticking to the union i'm sticking to the union oh you can't scare me i'm sticking to the union i'm sticking to the union